Hi everyone, Leanne here from Jada Blossom and it is time for the Build-A-Booth Christmas Add-Ons assembly video. Hey, so I'm using the brand new Build-A-Booth Christmas Add-Ons along with our Build-A-Booth die. I did put together these dies previous to the video um, using uh, Limba Savannah wood grain cardstock and G-Min stock Tindalo cardstock. There we go. And that one that looks kind of like a rusted tin, that was from Honey Bee Stamps Farm Fresh Holiday 6-inch Pad. So quickly, I'm just putting together this adorable little um, bunting for the Builder Booth Christmas for my Christmas booth. And this is a uh, paper tray ink, pure poppy cardstock and white cardstock. And then this is rainbow petite prints from Doodlebug in Candy Stripe and Sprinkles on the sprinkle side. And the tops there, that's American Crafts gold cardstock for little bells. And then I'll add the little yellow. So I've got little elf hats and little Santa hats. You can make them all elf, all Santa, whatever you want to do. I thought I would alternate. And isn't that sweet? Just adorable. And there you go. Next, I have, um, this is a, a little um, mistletoe cut out of that same Rainbow Petite Prince Candy Stripe and Sprinkles, Dark Chocolate Cardstock from Paper Tray Ink, and Pure Poppy Cardstock from Paper Tray Ink. There we go. And then I'm using my Barely Art glue to quickly add the little berries that were cut out of that same Pure Poppy Cardstock from Paper Tray Ink. So really quick and easy. And um, all my die cutting today was done with my Anna Griffin Empress machine and working on my Stampin' Up! pad as per usual using reverse tweezers, la da la 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 da. And there you go. And I cut that shadow out of Paper Trank black cardstock. So you can do a neat little silhouette of Santa and the reindeer. Now I'm putting together a string of lights out of Candy Stripe and Sprinkles um, from Doodlebug and Pure Poppy cardstock from Paper Tray Ink. And then silver cardstock from American Crafts for the little sockets. I'm using um, a Studio Catty embellishment wand to pick things up just to make it easy on myself. And I'm using my Barely Art glue again. You saw that on my two little booths, I did use Distress Oxide ink and Hickory Smoke around the edges and Close to My Heart White Daisy ink around the edges. You know, just for fun. And I did use some old brads. You can build your booth any way you'd like. That's why I thought I would just quickly put them together off screen and then I'll just be decorating the booths in this one. So there we go. So this is super simple. And there you have it. How cute is that? Just adorable, right? Okay, now I'm going to put together the North Pole sign. So I cut it out of uh, pure poppy cardstock from Paper Tray Ink and then white cardstock from Paper Tray Ink. And then I used some heavyweight vellum to cut the North Pole out so I could line up my word and still see the sign base from the Build-A-Booth dies behind it. And then I'm just going to fill in all the little letters like a little puzzle. And that way I can keep everything straight. And I just find this is the easy easiest way for me to do it. You know, I could have done it like one by one and, you know, but I find this is the easiest way for me to get the spacing correct. And then I have a sweet little sign for this adorable little Build-A-Booth Christmas add-ons or for my little Christmas add-ons for my Build-A-Booths. I just think it's so cute. You can make adorable little treats with that little treat box add-on that you can use or you can make a super cute Christmas cards. So there we go. I'm just going to peel off that heavyweight vellum and then now you have a North Pole sign. Isn't that cute? And now you can decorate your booths any way you'd like to decorate them. Oh, that's that one that looks like tin. I didn't even put the panels on that one. You can just cut, uh, cut out the base piece. Anyways, that's all. Thank you so much for stopping by. Be sure to hop on over to the Jada Blossom blog, Be Inspired by the Team, the Jada Blossom store to get your hands on this amazing, um, you know, release. And that is all. Thanks for watching. And we will see you soon in my next video. Bye, everybody.